Hey everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. We are the Hustle Couple coming at you today with a fireside chat. Bet you weren't expecting that one. Guess what? We didn't have any sales. Uh, normally we come with a, a whistle video. Yep. Okay, normally. But there's a caveat. We did have some sales, three <laughs> of them, and they went to our friend Patricia. And we yep. thank you very much. Without a viewer sale, we would have a zero. Zero sale day on eBay. Well, actually, Patricia bought things yesterday. Yeah. So we literally have sold nothing on eBay today. So far. Um, But what I wanted to discuss in this video. Oh, I have to get my notes. Oh, she's got notes. So. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, I'm back, I'm back. The sky is not falling. Are you sure? I refuse. I refuse to think that. I refuse. Same. I know that eBay is going through it. Okay, girl, it's going through it, you know? Oh, oh, can you, I'm going through oh, it, can you? what's happening? Girl, we are, <laughs> we're unprepared. Stand okay. by. Oh! Hey! <laughs> Speaking of going through it. I look way more awake now. Hey. Okay. <laughs> so when this happens, I have to do something. I cannot sit there and just complain about eBay and wait for it to eBay makes up, I think, a good at least 70% of our sales. So when eBay's down, yeah. we get down. Oh man, yeah. Mm -hmm. Things are not not pretty. Because when our eBay task says no task spending, I don't I don't like that. Okay. So we decided to run an experiment. Uh, we chatted with the people in the live this morning, and I want to tell you about the experiment, and then you can check in on it to see. So basically, what is happening, we think, as a community, the people that we talk to, we think that eBay is floundering with the algorithm named Cassini. That's what it's called. So when you hear people talk about Cassini, that's like right. what determines best match. And best right. match is what determines where you are placed in search. So we sell Chico's. Lots I bet you Chico's, didn't know that. Bet you didn't, right, yeah. This morning we went on live and mm -hmm. we went to see where we asked people to Can look. Can I just say real quick, mm -hmm. if you don't know what we're talking about going live, there's another channel, oh, yeah. link down below, called The Reseller Workroom. Yeah. We do live listing uh, 9.30 a.m. Today was less listing and more experimenting yes it's very helpful though i think so too so when you look for your own listings you get skewed results there are a couple ways around this one you can go and make an incognito window you can open that on your google chrome browser and yep. we will show you that in a minute and the other thing that you can do is ask your friends that live all around the country this is why the live chat is so helpful yeah you can ask them to look so we hadn't gotten any sales and we sell hundreds and hundreds of Chico's, you know this. So I said, can you guys look and see if we're on the first page? Just look up Chico's and see if any of our listings come up. Guess what? I looked, they looked nothing. Our listings were not on page one, not on page two, not on page three, not on page four. Uh, one of our members, our friend Tommy, he didn't even get to us until 240. So we were like the 241st or something like that's how far down oh, that's fun. any of our listings were. Okay. So we're like, what makes a listing these days, since eBay's changing, yep. what makes a listing go to the top? It used to be things like shipping and location and blah, blah, blah. And now people are saying it's sell through rate. It's all these things. Yeah. Well, we're going to get down to it. So we decided to do a three way test mm -hmm. and it's very simple. We, took all the variables out and we took all of the Chico size two items that are in our store. Yep. I'm going to tell you how we did this in a second, but I just want to lay it all out there. Chico, there was uh, about 96. Yeah. Almost, almost 100. 100. Yep. <clears throat> so we took those, I delisted them and I relisted them on Vendu so that they all came through at the same day. They're all, all things being equal, right? Because we know that time listed has some kind of effect. Mm -hmm. yep. So we wanted to take that variable out. So uh, on a third of them, I did free shipping. Okay. I didn't change the prices on anything. Okay. So there are regular Chico's prices, which are standard. I charge $29.95 for shirts, $24.95 for tank tops, $34.95 for sweaters, $49.95 for jackets. It's a standard thing. Mm -hmm. I did not change it. I also grouped the three groups randomly. 
So there's some pants, some sweaters, some tops. I just took every third in the list so that because sometimes oh, okay. we that's what you were doing. Yeah, sometimes we <laughs> list only pants, and I didn't want them all to be in one group. Yeah, like I was paying attention kind of, but I was off in like steaming world. So. Yeah, so I it's a random <clears throat> sample, but they yeah. all are cheap, and the titles are all the same. The photos are all the same. Most of them are on mannequin or flat lay. Like everything's the same. Okay. It wasn't like I listed some four years ago, and I didn't know how to do titles. No, these are all new listings in the last six months. Everything being the same. Okay. Yep. They were all fresh listings as of today. The first group was free shipping. And so it has a little green banner under it, free shipping. The next group was free returns. And what this does, if you are a top rated seller, if you offer free returns, you get top rated plus. plus. You get a little banner. Not only does it say free returns in gray, but then you get a little blue <laughs> and so that's a top rated plus listing and yep. you can sort by that i don't know if buyers do but you can yeah and then the next group and final group was i increased the promotion so i selected all 31 or 32 listings and i put i have the numbers these are skew numbers i put uh the ebay suggested mm -hmm. promotion which whatever that is yeah high it's, it's really, yeah Plus one percent. Okay. Because I wanted to like beat out the people that were just doing suggested. Sure. So I wanted to see which one of these metrics, free shipping, increased promotions, and free returns, if any, mm -hmm. has an effect on the search. Okay. All of these listings have a five percent coupon, which we're having trouble populating right now. Yeah, it's weird. Like when you click on the listing, it shows up, but not in the search results, which it normally does. Right. And all of them are on sale, which we need to make sure that that's happening, but they will be on sale when you see this video. So everything's equal. And I want to show you, if you're using Vendu, don't go off and do this in eBay. You have to start by delisting and relisting in Vendu. If you are just on eBay, you can end and sell similar. Should I repeat it? Or, I mean, delist, relist is, you can do that on eBay also. If you're only on right, right, but you have to end it and then you have to relist it or whatever like that. Sure, if you're going to try sure. this experiment at home, you can try it on your own or you can just watch our store and you can keep, don't buy these things. If you're just going to buy them to be nice, don't do that. <laughs> we need the experiment to really work. Okay. Cool. I want to see, I'm, it's twofold. I want to see what's coming up in search okay. and I want to watch it over a couple of days because we know that new items come up in search on the first, first page all the time. Yeah. I want to see which items stay on the first page. Oh, and I want to okay. see in the comments below what you guys are seeing. And you could just put like red keyhole top. That's the first one I see or, and, and keep checking back in with this video because over the weekend or Monday, I want to do an update video and I want to be able okay. to tell you, you guys, I think this is it. That would be awesome. Yes. Because we could come on here and just complain. That's a great idea. I know. <laughs> I loved Kate's comment yesterday. She was cracking up. Cause I was like, Comment below if you have any money. <laughs> that stands for every video. Comment below. <laughs> okay. So I want to show you uh, how to delist and relist in bulk in Vendu. This will just take a second if you're not a Vendu user. And how to end and sell similar end and relist in eBay. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to do your own sale, I want to show you how to do that. Okay. I mean, if you, you know what I mean, your own experiment. Sorry, yeah. guys. So, okay. We need Vendu, right? Vendu. Hey, Vendu. Hi, Ian. All right, so I just want to show you what I did. So I typed in Chico size two up there. Up here. Chico size two. And if you have all of your item specifics filled in on Vendu, this is why I list from Vendu because all my item specifics are stored there. I just want to show you that you can multi delist and relist in groups of 10, which made this very fast for me. So go up to multi actions on the top right, the blue button. And then go down to multi D list and relist. Oh, cool. And then you can select up to 10 on the side there. And it will automatically, while you do something else, and you, just do one or two so we can show them what it looks like. We're not going to actually complete this. Go D list and relist at the bottom there. Right here. Yep. And then it'll give you the options for platforms. Oh, cool. So you could do all of them and let it go on its own. I just did eBay today. And since since I listed these through venue, all my specifics are filled in. It will kick it back if you're missing item specifics, that okay. the required ones. Just letting you know. So normally, once you hit confirm, it 
takes it start it does it runs a thing on the side a sidebar comes up and then it will just be like one out of ten two out of ten it's very very quick and easy and i might start doing this every morning anyway because it brings this the search to the front page that's great um and then if you want to go to ebay i'll show you how to do the end and sell similar and i know a lot of baby resellers watch our channel and you might not know how to do this so let me just take 60 seconds and show people how to do this on the ebay yeah let me uh get this going here where do you want to start from just the listings active okay okay so what you can do is sort your listings so say you wanted to do your chico size two you would go and type in in the item title chico's size two in the value this is how you sort your own store and then you go search and this will come up with all the listings that have that in the title and then to to get to the bulk edit feature if you wanted to do something here like if you wanted to end them all and sell similar or end them all in your list right i want to show you two things okay Okay. click on the the box next to actions that selects everything this one right here yes now to end you can these see right here it says 98 selected now right <clears throat> when you are relisting on ebay you have to end the listings mm-hmm. and then you go to the ending list ended listings to sell similar or vice versa it's a two-step process okay that so you sense. can go to you can go to actions what i do is end them first sure i go to actions at the top top button it just says, oh, actions right here. <laughs> I didn't see it. It's okay. Actions. This is where I end it. We're not going to do this. Right I here. would go end listings. End listings. Okay, and then I would let that happen. Okay. Then I would go over to the sidebar. Yes, this yes, sidebar on the yes, left. yes, yes. Oh, right here where it says ended. Ended, and I would select all the ones. They would be showing up yes. right, right Well, here. they are because I already ended them earlier. See what I'm saying? They're there. Oh, I see. Because yeah. I ended them earlier today. And then go to act it once you select them there. Yep. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You can go sell similar or relist. Sell similar is up here. Yes. Relist right here as fixed price. No, just relist. I don't know about right. fixed price. Oh, right here. First button. Yep. Relist. Got it. And that's how you do this. And it takes you to a bulk action. And that's exciting. Now, go if you wouldn't mind, go back to the regular. No, no. No, yeah, no. Cool. We're not done. So if you want to run this experiment after you've completed the D-list relist, mm-hmm. now this is no matter if you're on Vendu or eBay, this is the process you need to do. You need to go to your active listings. So right now we're in unsold, so we want to go to active. And then we want to go and type in Chico size two because we've delisted and relisted. Chico's size two. Okay, and I'm going to show you the bulk edit feature so that you can do this on your own should you want to. Okay. A lot of people don't know where it is because it's hidden. So I want you to go to the button that says edit. Um, there right it here. is. Yep. Edit. Now you can edit everything at once. This is the bulk feature. Edit all 98 listings. Exactly right. If you wanted to. What I did was I went through and clicked every third one. And then I said edit selected. Okay. And that So just click a couple of them so we can see. Yeah. And then just go to edit selected. So this is like your first group. And the first group I did was free shipping. So when you go to edit oh, now, oh, sorry for the scroll, edit, edit selected, edit selected. And here's all, yep, continue. And, or is it, is this old edits? I don't know. So this is, this is where you can bulk edit. So see where now it says bulk edit up I there. See. Yep. So if you drop down that menu, you can edit prices. You can edit anything you want to in bulk. You don't have to go one by one by one. So what I did for free shipping is I went edit shipping policy. And that I oh, had right a free there. shipping policy made in my business policies, and I just edited them to free shipping. So you would use the select all checkbox yep. like that, go to bulk edit, and select whatever you wanted to edit. So I did, okay, so we did free shipping, show them the shipping one, and then the other one was free return. So shipping I can. policy. Yep. So right here, you can change your <clears> shipping <throat> policy, you can change your return policy. So I made a return policy that was free shipping and I mean a shipping policy, free shipping, and then a free returns. Okay. See, this is another reason why it pays to have your business policies set up correctly. Yes. From the very, from the, from go. So So now once I did this and I went back, the the list didn't change. It didn't repopulate. Uh So I was able to just keep selecting every third one and then skip one and then select every third one so that I had three different groups. And I was able to make these bulk edits. Okay. So now you can close this down. But yeah, if you wanted to, once you have your edits complete, you would click this blue submit all. Right. 
to and make your changes. I'm so glad this is on video, so you can just keep re-watching it if this is new to you. Bulk editing, this isn't just for running an experiment. You can bulk edit anything. Like yeah. if you needed to change your uh, first class to ground advantage, that's how you would do it in the bulk edit feature. Yeah. If you don't know how to make business policies, we have the video for you. And it is called Getting Started on eBay Part 1. It walks you through every single step of setting up your shipping, your business policies, your return policies, and making those. So you can go to that video as well. Yeah, we have a playlist that contains yeah. all five parts. Yeah. And it should be linked down in the description below. Some people think if they're well into eBay that it's too late to start business policies. Never. It's never <laughs> too late. So that's a really good feature about eBay is you can bulk edit. Now, caveat, note. Note, some of you at home that have just started using Vendu mm -hmm. are like, oh, my God, but what about Vendu? You can change your listings on eBay. What you cannot do is end them. If you end them on eBay, and that's why I showed you the bulk edit and delist and relist on Vendu, right? If you end them on eBay, you break the link. You relist them on eBay. Vendu does not know they exist. But you can change the shipping policy. You can change them to your heart's content on eBay because the link, the URL, the website address doesn't change. Right. As long as the website address doesn't change, you can make all the changes you want to in bulk edit on eBay. And your vendue is fine. It doesn't have to reflect the same things. So if you go to your vendue listing and you look down and it says eBay shipping policy is um, you know, paid and instead of free, that's fine. It's fine. eBay is still yeah, it's linked. Not your, yeah, if your vendue listing forms are not going to auto update with the changes you make right. on eBay. That's a good way of saying And it. that's fine. Yeah. It's fine. <clears throat> when they sell, they sell. When they, this is what, Vendu is so simple. So when something sells, the URL goes away and Vendu's like, I broke my link. Let's be sold. <laughs> <laughs> that's all it is. They don't care what's on the link. They just know that it's linked. Does that make sense? Kind of, yeah. Okay. All right. So now let's take a look in an incognito window, which means we're not logged into eBay. We're not looking at our own listings. Those results will be skewed. These kind of maybe skewed. These kind of maybe, yeah, because I think some, <coughs> excuse me, some stuff still gets shared, like location maybe from, I, I, I have no idea what I'm saying. Um, so the way you get to an incognito window is once you open your web browser of choice, ours is Google Chrome. Excuse me. Google Chrome. <laughs> <laughs> you up at the very top, you go file and then click new incognito window. And this is what it will look like when you bring it up. Okay. So we're going to go to eBay and look up Chico size two. So eBay.com. Not that stuff. Though, not that yeah. one. Just eBay.com. Okay. We're there not we signed in. Hi, sign in or register. I'd rather not. Thank you. I want to search for anything. What do I want to search for today? Chico size two. Oh man. <laughs> Chico size two. Noted. The art search is still broken. Boom. Okay. Just letting you know. See, I we're, we're it's still defaulting to tops, and have we haven't confirmed, but we believe it's because the most common stuff to sell for Chico size two is tops. Yes, so but that's not the only thing that's broken. If you click, it's all, absolutely not broken because I don't no, want to see. No, it's broken. I mean, that's what I say. That's what I meant. <laughs> That's what I see. <laughs> absolutely is broken. Because, yeah, click on all. Tops. It's still only tops. Why is it giving me a sleeve length filter? I, this, is not, this is not all. Okay. Anyway. If you do click on pants on the side, you can find them. Just letting you know, if you want to look at our store, it yes. is always linked below. Hey, there. Okay. So all. all just takes you to tops. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Still do it. Okay. Some people said theirs was fixed. Ours is not. So instead of us being on the 240th, I'm going to point out some listings that are ours. Hopefully, first one is this black shirt right here. This one right here with the mannequin. Our listings stand out very clearly to me. I know exactly which ones <laughs> they are every time. Okay, so that one. Um, and you'll know ours because it has a 96 at the end of the price. Boom. This one right here. Right there. And this one I put free shipping on. And so you can see the green oh, right there, call yep. out. Boom. Free four-day shipping. Okay. And then um, scroll, that scroll. blue one. This one right here. That one is a one with free returns. And so there's the blue checkbox that we were talking about. Oh, right here. Yes. That's a top-rated seller. And you can sort by top-rated seller, I it's believe. top-rated plus. Top-rated plus. That's yeah. what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweet. So what I'm asking, humbly. Are there more? Yeah, I, there should be. I don't know. 
That's well, that's, that's it for page one. That's, that's 60 items per page. Right. And that's the default, I think. Yeah. So, like, let's look at pants. Okay. And then we'll do the call to action here. Women's pants. <clears throat> okay. And for some reason, our coupon isn't showing up, but it, it is there. So there's our first one right here on right the black. Here. Yep. Top and those are, plus. so I did a free return on that one. Yep. And there's a bunch more of ours right here. There's right there, those these three. These, these, yep. Uh-huh. And so you can see one of them has sponsored, sponsored, sponsored. Those are all promoted. Okay. The other ones are not promoted. Oh. You see what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. And it's and it's showing up for higher. That's see? Weird. <laughs> you would think promoted would show up first, but yeah. the top rated plus in this case is showing up first. Okay. And then we got any more. Yeah, that's we got one this of ours. One right here. And yep. that one and is one. that one, the rolled both rolled cuff. So one of them is an unchanged listing. That's no, just no, a standard, no. right? No. No. I didn't do any I didn't do any unchanged standards. Okay. So this one must be is it free shipping? No. It's not. And it's not promoted. No. Then what was the other thing? Free returns. Free returns. And, and so it's should not we that so something's wrong there. That's an item number we could give the chat people. Are you sure about that? <laughs> what do you I mean? Think, I don't know. They always want an item number. Let me save that guy for later. Okay. Okay. This one has free shipping. Free shipping. Yep. And then you can also see our listings compared to everyone else's. They're very clear. I, I can tell ours right right there is one of our two of ours. Yep. One of so those are both promoted. You're you're right. We're like the only ones or one of the very few that have a completely white background. Uh huh. Even though that's what everybody says you need to have. Right. There's two more and these both yeah. have free shipping. Okay. Pants. <laughs> there we go. That's it. Okay. And then go to sweaters and jackets or there's jackets and sweaters that you can also, I'm just showing everyone where they can look. Uh, sweaters. Try sweaters. Okay, we're, we're ruling in sweaters Yeah, right now. look at that prime placement right there. Sponsored, sponsored, sponsored. So those are all promoted plus one. So promotions is working in sweaters for the right now, the second we're looking at this. Sweaters. Yep. Sweaters. <laughs> There's one of ours, hey, the red. This one right here. Yep. And that one is, what, what do we do with that one? That's sponsored. Pro promoted. Okay. Yep. So this just shows you a little bit. And then we drop off a little bit. There's one. Okay. And what do we do to that one? Free returns, top rated plus. Okay. Just get down to the bottom of the page here. Let's see. Uh, no, nope. none of those. Nope. Nope, nope. 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 Okay. And then let's look at jackets just for, just round out the top Coats, here. Jackets and vests. Bam. Hey, number two. I'll take it. Sponsored. Okay. Okay. Number two. Let's see. There's another one. Yes. Top rated plus. Top rated plus free returns. Okay. Hmm. There's one. Hmm. Whoa. This black and white swirly dude. Oh yeah, the swirly dude. Top rated plus. Okay. Oh, that's scary hands. <laughs> there's one that this asian jacket right here 3596 uh, uh, and then the leopard one right next right to there. it those are both oh right no there. right now this What's one's that one? top rated plus free returns this one is um and not, it's not from, it doesn't not, say promoted it does not i definitely edited this okay so we need to take a look at those two okay that's it okay so here's the call to action and i think this will help all of us here it is. Today is the first day. They're all going to be mixed and matched, and some are going to be on the first page because eBay pushes the brand new listings. Right. That's that we know that. Okay. What's going to happen is in today, and then in the next couple of days, which ones stay there? Mm -hmm. So if you could just put your eye on some of them, yeah. Scroll it just like we did, and like maybe just keep a little towel tabby or tab. <laughs> Tally, tab. There you go. Whatever. Because what I want to know is from people all over the country and before, maybe by Sunday night, mm -hmm. which ones are still on the first page for you? And if it's that 60 first page, a condensed version of the first page, that's even better. Yeah. Which ones are you seeing? We'll do our best to make sure the sale is on and the coupon is populated so that all those variables are gone. 
We're going to do our best to do that before this video goes live. And then also if, if like the two we had where we couldn't figure them out, if you see any of those, because it should either have a blue or it should have free shipping, which is green, or it should have sponsored, which is promoted. Yep. If you find any that don't have that, let us know. That'd be really awesome. Yes. Because I did go through and edit every single one of those things. There's no way it got past me. No way. And so then, then we have an issue that we can report to eBay and say, look, I bulk edited this and this one didn't, this one didn't go. Didn't take. And I wrote down all the numbers. <gasps> Let's check it. I could check it right now. <laughs> what are the numbers? Oh my gosh. This is so exciting. Cause uh... I'm so OCD. I was like, I'm writing down every single one. <laughs> so we can tell which ones are glitching. What I'm trying to do, you guys, is have all of us come We've together. We've made some improvements. They change the pictures are larger now. The format's a little different. Are you telling me we don't need square photos? What is going on? No, I think we still need square okay. photos. Okay. What's um, the number on these? Yeah, they should just like give it to you, but they don't. Okay. 10783. 107. 10783. So that should have been a promoted listing, and it's not. Hmm. Okay, next. I'm not, uh, I'm not sure the screen. Is that okay? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Okay, let me see here. Yeah, what's the skew on this guy? 10911. 10911, promoted. Also promoted. So maybe that's a population thing. Maybe we need to wait because, look, they were both at the end of the list. This was the last thing I did, and they were at the yeah, very end. because it definitely doesn't say sponsored. Okay, maybe refresh and see if anything changes. Okay, does that guy say promoted now? Well, that was his top rated plus. This one says top rated plus. Still didn't say promoted. This one still doesn't say sponsored. Nope. So what this tells me, just right out of the gate, there's an issue with promotions. You know, I would love to know that because yeah. I don't want to pay promotions unnecessarily. Uh, yeah, right. I would love for this result to be like, oh, girl, it's top rated plus. Go for it. And I'd be like, free returns all day, every day. Cheaper for me to do free returns than promotions. I hope that's the outcome. If you don't know, if you, you offer right about that, I know. Yeah. If you offer free returns and you're a top rated seller, you get a 10% off your final value fees yeah. and you get the blue check mark or banner or whatever it is. Whatever. Yeah. So if that ranks you at higher, I'm going to do that. It behooves you to get top rated seller for sure. Yes. There's some, you can look it up on Google. There's some things you have to achieve to get that status. But a lot of the people watching this have that status. So I'm just letting you know. Yeah. So anyway, if we can just band together as a group, use this video as your comment section and just keep coming back and like telling us what you see. Just please don't buy the things. Just <laughs> it, literally, if you want them, like message me. Don't buy them because that's going to skew everything. Those ones. You can buy anything else you want. Sorry just... if you're a Chico size <laughs> too in the market right now. Don't buy our stuff. <laughs> um, most people are like, please buy our stuff. Don't buy those. I want to know what's selling. I want to know if first page placement, because if everyone kind of like, you see what I'm saying? Yeah. The SKU numbers, we're, we're thinking of this as we go, are on the whiteboard in the listing. So you can write down SKU numbers in the comments below. It's going to take you some time, but this is going to help you. You see what I'm saying? If help all... us help you. <laughs> you see? You get it? You go from here to, to there. So write the SKUs, <laughs> maybe make it a little, it's, it was only like five for each thing. So like each category, write the SKUs, put in the comments. And then everybody else will put their SKUs in the comments. And then we can compare oh. day by day by day by day. We've got some people in here that will do this. And I am, this is the call to action. I am asking you to do this. If you don't want to watch another reseller video complaining about eBay being dead. <laughs> instead, if you want to be part of the solution, please help us. Help us out. Please. Yeah. Let's do a thumbnail right now. <laughs> I love how we do this live every time. <laughs> Y'all don't care. Nobody Thank cares. you so much for watching. We hope that you find this helpful, and I hope that it improves sales for all of us because we're going to crack the code today, baby. We sure are. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. Look at these two. Hi. Just say hi to your friends. I'll give you treats in just a second. I know. I know. You're a good boy. <laughs> good girl, picnic. I know, I'll get you treats.
say bye.